in part one of this video series about search algorithms, we will take a look at linear search algorithm. Before we delve into search algorithms, let's define what searching is. Searching can be defined as finding a particular item in the list of items. In computer science, search algorithms are used to search for a particular item in the list. Linear search is one such search algorithm. It is a simple sequential search that starts at the beginning of the list and moves through the items in the list, comparing the value you are searching for with each item in the list until it finds the match. Linear search does not require lists to be sorted and hence is easier to code. But since linear search does not require lists to be sorted, it can take a long time to find the item you are searching for in case of a long list. The steps in linear search algorithm are as follows. Start at the first item in the list. Compare the first item with the value you are searching for, which is also called a search term. If they match, then stop and exit the algorithm. If they don't match, then move to the next item. Keep moving through the items in the list until you find a match or you reach the end of the list. Let's take an example and apply the steps in the linear search algorithm. Imagine you have been given an unsorted list of numbers 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 9 and 5 that you can see on your screen and you need to search for the number 9 in the list. Now let's work through the steps in the algorithm. Compare the first items in the list 7 with 9 which is value we are searching for or in other words search term. Since 7 and 9 do not match, so move on to the next item. Now compare the second item in the list, which is 1 with 9. Since 1 and 9 do not match, move to the next item. Keep doing this until we reach the sixth item in the list, which is 9. Now compare the sixth item with the list 9 with search term 9. Since sixth item and search term match, we have found our item or search term in the list. Report that the item is found and exit the algorithm. We do not need to do any more comparisons. If we are to search for eight, which is not in the list, then we will not find the item in the list, despite comparing each of the items in the list with eight, and we'll have to report item not found and then exit the algorithm. 